Well, this evening, new information about a bizarre arson attack at the Ventura County Government Center. Four cars were destroyed. Another was damaged. News Channel 3 reporter Kelsey Gerkins joins us live from Ventura. And Kelsey, you know now more about what, how this uh, fire started. What started it? Beth, I am live at the Ventura County Government Center, and this spot right here is where a man allegedly started a massive fire. Now, we found out this evening he started the fire in his own car, and it was so big that it destroyed three nearby cars, and they were county vehicles. 36-year-old Jeffrey Landis is currently being held on $500,000 bail. He's accused of starting a fire early Saturday morning in the Government Center parking lot. A CHP officer noticed the fire and called for help. Fire crews put out the flames and found Landis near the cars carrying a backpack. Officers say Landis threatened to have a bomb in his backpack, but the bomb squad did not find any explosives. Landis was arrested with the use of a canine and rubber bullets and taken to the hospital for minor injuries before being transported to jail. Now investigators are trying to figure out why he did it. What, what his goal is, they don't know. Um, what his motive is, they, they still don't know. They're, I think they're trying to reach out, maybe uh, interview uh, people that know him, maybe spoke with him the day leading up to, to the incident, but they, they can't determine it just yet. Investigators say Landis is from Santa Monica and at this point do not know if he has any ties to the Ventura County Government Center. And tonight everything is back to normal here at the Ventura County Government Center and Landis will be arraigned here at the Government Center tomorrow morning. Reporting live in Ventura, Kelsey Gerkins, News Channel 3. Okay, thanks.